Hello, everybody. This is another All Western Rant. As we get ready to prepare for the, the Thanksgiving holiday on tomorrow, uh, this particular rant, I just want to bring um, to everyone's attention about, you know, just the purpose of Thanksgiving. Uh, many of us, we, we're, we're going to be celebrating Thanksgiving because obviously because of what the holiday entails, which in other words means that you're just giving thanks for, you know, on certain things that that then happen in your life, um, certain things that you're thankful for, certain things that, you know, you feel that you're blessed to either have or, you know, that you're getting or you desire or, you know, there's different stuff like that. There's there's nothing wrong with, you know, giving thanks and, you know, just being appreciative and also being content in things that um that even God himself has um, provided you with. But, however, I want to challenge everyone to this this. Uh, Thanksgiving. I want to challenge everyone to not not only just have a spirit of giving, but also have a spirit of forgiveness. So this one, Rand, I want to talk about about the actual having a, the spirit of forgiving. Now, there there are um, there are many of us right now. Uh, we're dealing with uh, different circumstances, especially throughout this year, where we deal with different things, dealing with you know either friendships, relationships, uh, situation at jobs, you know. Um, uh, does does anything that that came across your way that that challenged you to um uh to you know um either dislike a person or a situation or a thing or you know that or anything you know what I'm saying so in this rant I just want to uh, just just bring it to your attention that not not only having a spirit of thanksgiving but also have a spirit of forgiving as well I want to challenge everyone to uh, to forgive. Uh, those that are uh, that came against you, or as the Bible say, forgive those that trespass against you, or you know, as other um, uh, religious um, doctrine says, on uh, you know, those that um, did you wrong or wrongdoing and stuff like that. I want to challenge each and every last one of us to um, to have that that spirit of forgiveness as well. I want to challenge us to um, to let go of things that happened in the past, because right now in this season. Right now, um, there are many opportunities that's going to be presented to you that uh, that uh, the Most High God do want to want to provide for you. But at the same time, you know what I'm saying, he don't want to give you a precious gift, you know what I'm saying, or giving, you know what I'm saying, where he know that you're just going to do any old crazy thing to it or be disruptive with it or even destroy it because of your, because of your mindset or where your mind is at, you know what I'm saying, your mind's not ready to actually receive it, you know what I'm saying. So... Let's let's practice forgiving. Let's practice letting things go. Let's practice if uh, everyone, if anyone that did you uh, wrong in the past, let's practice leaving that baggage at the door and just leaving it there and get rid of it once and for all. For all. So you can uh, walk into the um, the promises and blessings that they, that on um, the Most High God have in store for you. Uh, this this is one of these things that I'm learning. Uh, and as myself and I'm doing it um, and as I'm learning to let a whole lot of stuff go and totally um, like I always say fight fate with faith uh, and I'm, I'm totally moving in, in that uh, aspect and by me moving in that and allow to just let stuff go and just let uh, God just truly deal with it and stuff you know what I'm saying it, it, been, um, it, it gives me a peace of mind you know what I'm saying? Uh, it makes me even more happier than you know where I was in the past and stuff. Uh, it, was, it makes me even love people even more. In other words, it makes me become a, a new person or a new being. You know what I'm saying? So I want to challenge everyone the same way. You know what I'm saying? Um, this Thanksgiving, let's not only switch it to you know a, a spirit of a Thanksgiving, but let's switch around to a, a spirit of forgiving as well. You know what I'm saying? You know, so even this. You know, even this holiday, you know, you can switch around and say, you know, you're in the spirit of forgiving. You know what I'm saying? It's forgiving. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know what I'm saying? The stuff in like, even in the word forgiving and stuff, that in itself is just powerful in itself. You know what I'm saying? The, the, the spirit of thanksgiving is that you're giving thanks and stuff. Right? In other words, you're giving or you're allowing an opportunity to feel thankful. So why not, at the same time, why you allow the opportunity to feel thankful that you also forgiving, that you actually forgiving 
people are, you know, that transpasses transpasses as well. It's that that you forgive it, that you moving forward with your life as well. You know what I'm saying? That you letting things go, that you're not bringing nothing into, you know, your your future, your your um your present and your future. So as I get ready to come to a close of this on rent, um, I just want to uh, let y'all know that do not do not let your um your past dictate your present so it can determine your future. But however, you let whatever negative thing in your past, let it stay in the past and let it go and create a new present so you can have a wonderful future. So so that's that's all that's all I'm gonna say for one uh, this rant. Um like I always um uh, fight faith with faith for everybody and also y'all have a while safe and happy holiday happy thanksgiving and you know uh, oh by the way uh you know don't don't do too much to damage your temple now because you know your temple is your dwelling place as well so talk to y'all soon bye